morning y'all welcome back to the channel i'm in afternoon uh traffic lots of traffic and so i'm just uh keeping my eye on the road and i'm headed about my destination listen y'all thank you thank you thank you thank you for supporting the channel i appreciate each and every one of you all i'm starting to feel a little uh, feel a little bit better okay as far as my sinuses and all of that it seems like um in the morning and in in the evening it seems like i get stuffier but i am feeling uh better okay listen y'all i want to come on and um give you all an update about the student loans okay i just got some information i have some reports saying that um you all know actually before i get into it you all know that i uh brought some news coverage okay concerning uh student loan payments actually uh student loan forgiveness rather specifically and in the uh uh, in the beginning days, okay, of my channel, um, I covered uh, the topic of student loans, okay? But what I want to talk about is the fact that um, some news came out, okay, today, or I got the information today, rather. Let me sneeze, y'all. Hold on. So, <coughs> excuse me. Sorry about that. I just got some information. And President Biden, okay, and his uh, current administration, Department of Education, <laughs> they are actually going to uh, give student loan borrower relief sooner, earlier than expected, okay? Uh, there's something called the SAVE plan, okay? That's, uh, it's an acronym, I don't know what it stands for. S-A-V-E, okay? Please comment in the chat if you know more about it. But they're now saying that, um, that those student loan borrowers who are enrolled in the SAVE plan will actually get uh, immediate immediate relief, I believe, starting this month, okay? It was scheduled to begin in July, but it's gonna be sooner than expected, okay? Um, many people, I would assume, are excited okay. about that news, those who are enrolled in the plan. Then there may be some who may be skeptical to say, okay, well, um, why sooner than expected? Some people may even say, what's the catch to being enrolled in this SAVE plan, okay? Some people may say, well, it seems like if you're going to give student loan relief, student loan borrower relief or forgiveness, you should just forgive it without having to put the student loan borrower through all these hoops and channels and having to fill out this paperwork and submit this doc documentation, okay? After all, don't they know who took out student loans and who did it? Let me know your thoughts on that. But the question, the overall question I want to ask is, why is the current administration so focused on student loan forgiveness? Okay, now, this has been a journey, right? I've covered in videos where um, they were going to do this, or they had this plan, and then it was blocked by the Supreme Court, or blocked by the judicial system, blocked by this court, that court. So, it hasn't been an easy process, okay? But it seems like each time uh, President Biden and his current administration, when they saw what may have seemed like a defeat with one type of plan, okay, they came back and said, hey, uh, we're going to do things differently. And they introduced uh, another plan, okay? So the question I have is, why are they so stuck on student loan forgiveness now, okay? Do you feel like it has anything to do with the current election season? Okay, coming up, 2024 uh, presidential election. Um, I have even asked the question, okay, is he trying to, is this current administration trying to uh, get and hold on to the black vote? Okay, um, data seems to suggest, right, that the majority, um, or at one time, okay, uh, data suggested, I don't know, it could still be that, be that way, but at one time data suggested that the majority percentage of student loan borrowers were um, black Americans, okay? Are those classified as African-American or black? Um, and so I just wanna know your thoughts. Are they trying to get the black vote and keep the black vote by offering student loan forgiveness? Uh, is this what they should be doing anyway? Is this just, is this just simply the right thing to do? Um, do you feel in any way, uh, and I've spoken on reparations before, okay? Do you feel like in any way that this could possibly be uh, their form of reparations, okay? Certainly, in my opinion, this is not 
uh, reparations, okay? But do you feel like in their eyes that this is in some way their reparations, okay? Um, and I say not because it's not just specifically for Black Americans. Although Black Americans may be the majority, um, these reparations, or what, let me not call it, let, let me not even call it reparations, right? This student loan forgiveness is not specifically for Black Americans, okay? I don't think we can call it uh, reparations, right? So let me know your thoughts on that. I just had that on my mind. I wanted to share it with you. Um, make sure I'm paying attention to the road here. It looks like there's a slowdown up ahead. But yeah, that's the question that I'm asking. Um, what is the catch to this SAVE plan? Okay, if any of you all have any insight, the SAVE plan, that's S-A-V-E, why are they making or requiring that as a condition for uh, student loan forgiveness? Why are they requiring that borrowers, student loan borrowers, um, enroll in this SAVE plan? Why not just forgive uh, those plan, uh, those um, student loan borrowers, okay? All right, y'all. Thank you so much always for supporting the channel. I appreciate you all. I'm headed to my uh, destination now. I'm moving. Uh, I'm moving. I'm not moving, but I'm moving around out and about on the roads. Uh, please be safe. Watch your surroundings at all times. No matter, excuse me, no matter where you are, uh, no matter what time of day or night, okay? Um, I'm going to be coming back with another update concerning the uh, migrant crisis. Um, make sure you check out my video that I did this morning where I talked about the fact that, uh, well, I don't want to give it away. I want you to watch it so you can learn and um, get information on what I talked about. But, you know, a lot is going on pertaining to our country. Uh, I have more information that I'll be sharing. I got some information today concerning our food supply. Remember when I asked the question, was our food supply under attack? I got some more information, y'all, that may very well suggest the question, uh, suggest the answer to the question uh, that I have been asking. Is our food supply under attack? Okay, but I'll share that in another video. As always, thank you, thank you, thank you so much for your support. Please invite someone to uh, subscribe to the channel and join our community here. I feel like I share, uh, and many of you have shared with me that the information here is valuable. Um, you all are cheering me on wishing me well and I appreciate you all okay thank you so much for your support thank you for your feedback okay and uh, I'll see you all in the next video